thought your essay was interesting. A spell check might be nice on, on these essays. Love those extracurriculars. You're not in yet, but uh, no, things are looking pretty good. So you don't want to go to college? Jesse Fisher. Professor Peter Hoberg. I know Ohio is not as glamorous as New York, but they're throwing me a retirement dinner thing. When is it? Weekend of the 25th. You know, check your schedule. Checking now. Ah, looks like I have to shift some things around. I'll be there. He never writes, he never calls. Oh, hey. <laughs> what, was that Professor Fairfield? Yeah. She was like the best teacher I had here. She was like the second best teacher I had here. Jesse, this is my daughter, Zibby. Hey. Hi. She's a sophomore. What was your major? I was English with a uh, minor in history, just to make sure I was fully unemployable. You're like back in college. You're overdressed. I don't know if you know this, but uh, I'm a few years older than you. Did you think this was like a romantic thing? Just kidding. We connect really well, don't you think? I just can't figure out if it's because you're advanced or because I'm stunted. Because I'm advanced. What the hell are you doing? I don't know. Nobody feels like an adult. It's the world's dirty secret. I never met anyone that I trusted until now. I'm 35. It doesn't bother me. Well, it bothers me. My advice to you is put some armor around that gooey little heart of yours. Yeah! One of the things I loved about being here was the feeling that anything was possible. You get out of school and anything could happen. And then you do get out and life happens. So you're saying I should prepare myself for suckiness? No. A liberal arts education solves all your problems. In a land.